Hey, new developers, Jack Wallen here to help you get things done. Let's find out how to connect a local Git repository to a remote repository on GitHub. The first thing to be done is the creation of a new repository on GitHub. Log into your GitHub account and go to the dashboard. From that page, click the Repositories tab, and in this new window, click New. In the resulting window, give the project a name and an optional description. Depending on what this project is used for, you might make it private. Click Create Repository, and GitHub will do its thing. The address of the new repository will be https colon slash slash github.com slash user slash project name dot git, where user is your git username and project name is the name you gave your new project. Now the fun begins. On your local machine, create a new project folder with the command mkdir my project. Change into that newly created directory with the command cd my project. Initialize the repository with the command git init. Now let's create a readme file with the command touch readme.txt. Add the new file to the staging area with the command git add period. Now we're going to create our first commit. To create the commit, issue the command git commit dash m double quote added readme double quote. The next step will make use of the GitHub repository address. What we need to do is add the local repository to the origin, which is the name of the remote repository where you want to publish your commits of the remote repository. This is done with the command git remote add origin https colon slash slash github.com slash user slash project name dot git, where user is your GitHub username and project name is the name you gave your new project. At this point, you can then push your work to the remote with the command git push dash u origin master. Let's add another file and push it to the remote repository. Issue the command touch license. Add the file to the staging area with the command git add period. Issue a new commit with the command git commit dash m double quote added license file double quote. Push the changes to the GitHub repository with the command git push dash u origin master. Now if you look at the repository on GitHub, you'll see both the readme and the license files are there. Hey everybody! Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel. And be sure to check out more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.